there's a accident. Apparently they struck a light pole and looks like he struck a fence or something. Apparently it's a 16 year old driver. So uh, unknown if he's gonna be intoxicated or he was speeding or what the deal is. Who's driving the car? You? You're okay? You need to see an ambulance? Okay, sit down, sit down. You were on the vehicle? I was the passenger. Okay, sit down right there on the curve. Yes, sir. 639, send me uh, Medcare, and you're gonna have to notify AEP there's a light pole cut in half. Hey, what's going on? What happened? I was coming, man, and there was a kids on a bike. I started skidding, and... How fast were you coming? I gotta say, probably like 30, man. 30? This is more than 30, man. You cut a pole in half. The ice. I'm so sorry. So Do you have a driver's license? No. ¿Qué pasó, sir? The only witness I think. What happened? Lo que pasó es que yo oí que el vato anda venía rechinando las llantas como que venía de allá y cuando yo oí que rechinó las llantas ya venía sin control no venía el carro y así y llegó y se zampó ahí. I'm just glad I was late because as soon as I get here my two-year-old is literally playing like right here. Yeah, it's crazy, man. We got mom right here. Yeah. Where's she at? She's just right there. No, he, he just struck the pole and that fence there. Calm down. I, okay, I everybody f***ed up. It's okay. It's not okay, but I asked you, were you driving? Were you driving fine? You said yes. And so, it was somebody saying that you were, that you were peeling out. You realize, I can tell if you've been peeling out. You realize, right? Because I've done this for 20-something years. I can tell on the tire. Okay. Were you driving fast? He's pretty shaken up. I mean, he's lucky to be alive, you know, for you to cut a pole in half. He just confessed that he was driving reckless. So basically, I'm gonna write up the report as a reckless driver. It is a, a class B misdemeanor. I literally got this car, like, a month ago today. This is it's just a sports car showing off. Uh, it but, happens. You know, I, but I, I Hopefully thought, he learns from this. Yeah, no, I know, but I, I think he knows better, like. They're lucky. Yeah. The number one problem that parents make out here, um, they get a little ahead of themselves and buy their kids a car without them having a driver's license. A lot of us law enforcement parents are overprotective because of the dangers and everything we see out on the road with, with involving juveniles. It kind of takes a, a toll on us and, and our kids as far as how we're going to raise them. Police are here to protect the serve. Everyone should take accountability. We should all look to law and order. There should be justice. You should trust the police. There should be a lot more transparency. We come together as a we nation. Fight. There should have been. We should.